here let's talk about it real fast uh kanye west <laughs> and this is people's fault i fault people for this so if people ask me who do i blame who do i this y'all fault <laughs> i got to i have no choice man i got nobody else to blame but y'all y'all are the reason for this nobody else This is y'all fault. Because y'all put up with all this. Mm-hmm. You see, the main problem of the, of the substance that you've seen in the world today has reflected into a new foundation. What's up? And the new foundation is that we are going to play the part. Everybody wants to be a victim. It is the dumbest thing I've ever seen in this new millennium, this new era that we're in right now today. Everybody wants to play the role of the victim. It's like the ants is in the air like, me, 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 pick me. I wanna be a victim. Everyone's lining up. They're lining up. Yeezy's jumped over the jump man just to jump right back over to the jump man. <laughs> you leave Nike because they wouldn't give you what you wanted. You kick, cry, and scream. Kid cried and screamed. Right? That's what you did. You kicked, cried, and screamed. And why? Uh, I'm not deleting comments. That's YouTube. So whatever you put in there, YouTube wasn't cool with it. <laughs> That's the first thing I've seen from you. So I guess you should be advised in what you put in the comments section. Because they the ones that said, nah. Delete that. <laughs> like that's YouTube, homie, and you the moderator, so you sh you should know better. Now, when we get across to the gist of things, I want people to understand something. Kanye West came out with said, "Forget it, I'm gonna do my own thing." Sound familiar, don't it? He got the Adidas deal. He's a billionaire. He did all this and one little thing didn't go his way. What did Kanye do? Freak out. Do a big fit. Messed up his whole company. 
And they basically took it from them and everything. Said, we're going to sell the rest of your stuff, and you can go. Adidas, nigga. Then he met the Adidas, the owner of Adidas. Went over there, chilled with him, thought everything was back in order. And he went right back to doing his bullshit again. Adidas, nigga. <laughs> so then he get mad. Then he goes online and sell y'all AirPods for like twenty dollars. All y'all rush to go buy the Kanye AirPods. I'm supporting yay. You supporting celebrity? See, that's y'all problem. Y'all run under celebrity so much, then y'all get mad when y'all get played by said celebrity. He's a goddamn celebrity. Y'all buying it not because it's a great product. You're buying it because you're buying celebrity. It's Kanye West. We're buying it. And because they know y'all stupid enough to do it, they're going to keep doing that to you. So y'all went and ordered it. Full five weeks pass. No product. Four or five weeks pass. No product. So everybody's still scrambling right now. Like, what's going on? One of the celebrities said, I bought your product, man. I'm just showing you, man. They said that I canceled the order myself on my end. I never canceled the order. No. All the orders are being canceled. None of y'all are getting those AirPods. See, what Kanye wanted to do was show y'all the show Nike the interest that he still got the people. So now that Nike see that, he can go run back to Nike. The same people he was talking shit about that was discriminating against him. And guess what's gonna happen with Nike? The same damn thing that happened when the last time he was there. Kanye West is gonna do exactly what he did before. He's going to want to do something. They ain't going to be with it. And he's going to fall out and throw a fit and leave Nike. We don't need Nike. Let's boycott Nike. Now we got to boycott Nike because Kanye said so. <laughs> don't y'all know how this movie plays out? Don't y'all know this shit already? This is vintage Kanye. But see, that's the problem. You put your trust your energy, your love, everything that you know into somebody that don't deserve it. Kanye West is once again from the swindle, y'all, with fashion. Then he gonna be right back boasting and bragging again. Oh, for sure.
You see, that's what they want to do. I don't believe in it. Most people sleep minded. Pretty much. <clears throat> it's foul ways nowadays. And that's how people are. Kanye West has made a killing off of the public that supported all of his dumb shit. Like them garbage bags he had y'all wearing. Those just sloppy pajamas, flannel stuff that was cut in half, cheap ass material he was selling y'all for $300 a piece. $600 and everybody who broke seemed to be buying it. <clears throat> he made money off all you hipsters. If you a hipster, it was right up your alley. He needs those for the, the Jewish people. Did I tell you what Kanye does? He talks about the Jewish people because he wants to go running back over there. And he gets all the brothers to support him. And y'all jump on his side and he go running back with his tail between his legs right back over there to them. Because that's where he want to be anyway. Why do y'all keep falling for it? That's why he went running back to Nike. They both, they basically gave him the the negro treatment last time you're just a negro take what we give you he was like all right okay i'm gonna bounce and i'm gonna be bigger than ever and he bounced and got bigger than ever then what happened he went right back coming right back to them I'll be a good Kanye this time. I promise. <laughs> and people, please stop comparing him to Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving didn't do that. What Kyrie Irving did was said, okay, Nike said, hey, 
we don't like what you did and da 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 we ain't selling the new Kyrie shoes no more he was oh okay bet I had the number one selling shoe but okay cool I'm gonna go do my own thing now I'm in a better situation the people are responding they coming out buying the shoes and I feel ten times greater no fear The Yeezys came through. <clears throat> they came through and bootlegged. The Yeezys came through and got bootlegged by the people they signed with. Because they knew they could. They knew Kanye is too distracted with all the ancillary bullshit he got going on around him that he ain't focused he ain't paying attention so if you got somebody around you that's not focused they don't pay attention you can do what you want to do You can literally do what you want to do. No one's going to stop you. No one's going to care. But Kanye West keeps using his celebrity to mind, to mind bog everybody involved. And as long as he keeps having people show up, he going to show out. You see, because that's the goal. The goal is to use y'all as the collateral. If Kanye West shows how many sales he got for those AirPods at $20 a pop, they're going to look at that and go, oh, these are some good numbers. Okay, I went to the wrong place. But they're going to say these are some good numbers. You know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking we can maximize this. <clears throat> you did this on the strength of you. Imagine if you got Nike behind you now. So now he used y'all to get a Nike deal. And y'all ain't even finna get the AirPods for $20. He gonna get y'all y'all money back. <laughs> oh, God. Y'all gonna learn one day. Y'all gonna learn one day. Keep telling people they don't listen. Everybody, welcome to Walmart Warehouse. How you doing? Good. Thank you for smelling me. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Happy shopping. All right. Now, as we were saying. Oh yeah, it's snowing in Chicago. Snowing in April. But that's what happens. You bring people along. And this is what happens. And they got knockoffs everywhere. Knock off Yeezys. They got them everywhere. So the knockoff Yeezys consistently sold. 
the designs, everything. This what got Kanye upset. Because he didn't know he could get bootlegged by his own company. And he's mad at the person they brought in to come in and bootleg his, his uh, product. But that's, that's why I don't want to have anything to really do with him because he hasn't shown any backbone or, or standing for anything real. It's always about him. Then he gets come crying to us about the misjustice that we see and suffer every day and play off our pain while he go capitalize and cash in a big old check. Kyrie <clears throat> did it his way. Got his own shoe. His own thing. He said, I'm done. With all y'all controlling the game. I'm done with all that. And that makes sense to me. Yeah, well, that's what happens in the world when people don't do what they should or do what they say they're going to do. Hello. Uh, where are your watches? Watches? That's going to be my jewelry down over here. Okay. Okay, cool. Thank you. Yeah. So. a lot of different changes you've seen happen. What has Diddy done that meant anything lately? He's done absolutely nothing. Kanye West doing exactly what I told y'all they were going to do.
ain't do what you ain't do, man. <laughs> it's it's crazy and goofy as it sounds. Everybody gonna run out and buy the new the new shoes from Yay on Nike. Watch. It's crazy. The power of celebrity. And that's what the people are doing right now. They buy a celebrity. That's why they pay these guys to market to you. And then they buy the product. It's about who's selling it to you. Man, this yay. Anyway, have you heard anybody talk about his album? I ain't heard nobody really talk about it. At all. Didn't he drop both of them? Volume 1 and Volume 2. Then he dropped both of them. I ain't heard no, no convo for those. Serious, it's like it's just street do do. <laughs> I mean, really, it did nothing. That album did less than nothing. It was really do do. It just sat there and stunk. Well, when people come in and kind of tell you what's what, you got a choice. You can go in that direction or not, but totally it's uh, your decision. Especially when dealing with this scenario. I really don't see things like how everybody else do. I see, I see ahead in the future. I don't think in the right now. I'm 10 miles ahead. So I already saw this move coming. That's why I told y'all about it. I'm trying to get everybody else there. What did I tell you Ye was gonna do? He doing all of that so he could what? Come back here. He was doing all of that so he could do what? Come back here. Yeah, many people, many people uh, discuss it, but others will not. It's just how it is. Oh, he'll come out and play the victim. Right now, it's cool to be the victim, right? Everybody wants to be a victim. Oh, yeah, I finally watched The Quiet on the set. All four episodes. And boy, oh boy, oh boy, do I want to speak on that. So we'll do that on Carcino for life. But 
yeah, we're going to have to talk on that. So, we'll tackle that and get that going. That's not there either. Big Sean song is all right. Whatever you like on the table, sir, okay? okay. Two, three things, four things, whatever you like. Hi. All right. Three, four, five, can't Now. It's called precision. Well, pretty much. But... got to figure it out one day on their own. Absolutely not. Yeah, but I like Benny's flow better. 
And when Pusha T got on the song with him, you know, they sound more authentic. Let's put it that way. I hear Benny, I believe it. I hear Pusha, and I'll be like, that's a nice rhyme. see who's gonna be the first one to buy these y'all gonna be here in the chat right now knowing y'all gonna buy them kanye west when they come out on that He said he he bought gators, ostrich, snake, and maru. Man, shoot, they had a ten thousand dollar ostrich jacket in, in Hawaii. It was fly. I'm like, let me try on that ostrich. <laughs> we tried it on, man. We was rocking the ostrich. Like, look at me, I'm decked out in my ostrich. <laughs> yeah, this is my ostrich. <laughs> my ostrich jacket. Man, we was up in the Ferragamo store, Salvatore Ferragamos. Been trying to split Griselda up. I heard Benny, man. I was like bringing bringing the '90s back. Then I heard the machine, and it was over. I said, "This dude here." The machine, Conway the machine, ain't nobody, nobody messing with him. <laughs> the 
that's a wrap. Nobody messing with him. You think Pusha T can mess with Conway the Machine? It's not even close. Yeah, well, what side, you know, he just going, do, 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 do. <laughs> what side is I? Right? Well, he ain't really no rapper, man. But he just make the song connect. Y'all listen to them before Kanye West right now. Everybody still want to believe in Kanye, boy. I swear, they be trying to give Ye another chance. This dude didn't said F black people, then sat in Donald Trump's lap. He done did everything to say F y'all. Then when they do him wrong, he come running back to y'all. Look what they did to your hero. Start talking about he got and all kind of stuff, man. And, and he go, what he do? They can't stop me. Black power. We got that check for you. Ready to do the deal? Okay. All right. All right. Black power over. Okay, it's over. No, put your fist down, nigga. Where do I sign? Kanye West. I watched the dark side of the ring on who? I've seen a lot of dark sides on the ring. Bam Terry Gordy. Uh, do I believe it was a fall or he just committed suicide? He might have committed suicide. I don't know. But for it to happen that way. That ended up, that ended all the people coming from the ceiling.
Well, Brian, Brian, all those guys, man, it's, it's a lot. A lot of this we touch on on the Patreon. Then I get it for the Brian Shaw. I sell it for the Shaq, but I get it for the Brian Shaw. Homie hit flee, he down the ride. He went and did a 17 year bid and came back Zion size. <laughs> All right. I'm back. Back on the couch. Vontae Davis. Ah, uh, man, I knew he had some mental issues when he just walked off the field and said, I'm out. <laughs> what? I quit. I'm getting fried out here today. So I retire. <laughs> this guy, man, I'm getting fried out here. Speed and Tyrone. So how many of y'all going to buy the new Kanye's on night? How many of y'all going to buy the new Kanye's when they come out? Don't lie. Don't lie. Not me. <laughs> Don't be rocking. Well, they were kind of floss, you know. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, my mama gave them to me for Christmas. Well, for my birthday. Y'all gonna do it. Y'all gonna fall victim. Start back by a celebrity. Yep, you gonna do it. It's a matter of time. You gonna do it. All right. Let me get ready for the casino for life.